Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Onion, and this is One Hour, One Life. Zandir is very cool. We're in the Milks family again. It's alright. I don't know. This might even be the exact same village. It looks way too well organized, though. Is he stealing all of the knives? I feel like he is. Yep. Pretty sure he was the one stealing all of the knives. Uh, I don't think this is the same village. Raw french fries. Man, one thing about this arc gameplay, if I wasn't already tired of so many other aspects of the recent updates, being born in these big villages is, uh, yeah, not quite as fun as uh, getting the early starts. Like, before the arc updates, just about all of the um, playthroughs that we did, there was a possibility to be born to an Eve, and or to actually be an Eve yourself. Uh, get to start a village from scratch and all that kind of stuff. I miss that a lot. I just never seem to be uh, logging on around the time that there's an early village. It was too hot anyway, so it doesn't hurt to uh, move out of the way. Hello. Thank you. Bye. Get out of here. No relation. We're at peace with them. Talk to me so I can know your language. Fine. Be gone, tall creature. Ah, I pair now. This is glorious news. I have no idea where we are or what's around us, though. Because my mother was a bit... Um, Neglectful. Full of green beans right there, that's good. This looks like the smith up here. Oh, what a waste. What a waste of iron. I know what, there's tons of iron here, but gross. Ha ha ha. Oh, I thought it ran into me. They just move really slowly for whatever reason. Ugh, what a waste. It doesn't even go anywhere either, which is even more wasteful. Gross. Not in the mood, folks. Not in the mood. For waste. Somebody eat that green bean already? Ah, not gonna be any... Not gonna be enough empty bowls around. Ugh. Do I not have clothes on or something? I guess I only have the fleece, don't I? Okay, let's try to look around for some pants, I guess. Got potatoes growing, we've got sauerkraut, two already fermented. Hello? Can I not pick up that, uh, that crock? I guess not. It's a bit garbage. I guess it kind of makes sense, because I'm a small child, but you would think you'd be able to pick up a crockpot. Oh, peppers. Nice. Wonderful. Man. Well, as much as I miss it, what if we did leave? What if we did go try to uh, start our own village elsewhere? And not worry about um, all these folks here and their nonsense. I guess I wouldn't be able to get very far because this place clearly has all of the iron that's available in the immediate vicinity. I'm going to starve to death again. Another sauerkraut over here. I'll leave that real quick. Is that a bowl of salt? Ha! What fool would go and make salt and not have anywhere to put it? Ha ha! What a fool. 
If you didn't check out my last episode, I did that exact exact thing. Somebody else had already gotten the salt for the sauerkraut by the time I'd returned, so I just left on the ground. Haha, -ha, what a fool. Okay, we got bows and arrows. We've got two milkweed farms. She didn't know about the one to the south, I guess. A lot of sauerkraut, holy cow. Way more than we need. Yeah, this whole place is uh, pretty well set up, I'd say. I don't see really any way that we could help out with anything. So I think I am sorely tempted uh, to just leave and try to do my own thing. I guess the smartest thing to do, though, would be to at least take a basket with us. I'd be very surprised to find any kind of uh, other clothes around. Yeah, there's not. This is turkey broth. Uh, if we were to find another empty bowl, I wouldn't mind taking that with us. That'll be good. Alright, now we're on our way. I've only got a couple of of foods though, so I have to keep that in mind. Oh wow. So here's a little early start it looks like. Planted carrots. There's regular carrots just sitting around. Bowls with berries in them. Plates. Still a little bit too close. And I don't see water around either. There's a pond, but I don't see a well. Oh, it's a dead pig. I was worried for a second. Tiny bit of swamp there, but nothing good. There's a well. And here's a pond. One. What was that? A pig? No, another pond. Good. That's not a bad spot then. Is there clay around though? Oh, there are several uh, spots here. Ah, here's some clay. Here's some soil. Here's someone's carrot farm. Oh, wow. Actually, a pretty good go of it right here. We could probably turn this into a place. They've already got the well site. There's no iron, though, which is the problem. I could go steal it from the other village, I guess. Yeah, we eat that. That's good. We've got bowls. There's plates. There's a crock pot. What else do I need? That's probably about it. I uh, could turn this into the other thing. Um, a kiln. Because with the bellows here, we could use that as the forge. And then make the oven somewhere else where it's out of the way. Is there any tool reeds around? And are there any wild plants either? I probably don't have access to any kind of milkweed. It's probably all been picked in the area. Yeah, if I don't start out in the early, early world, it's nearly impossible to find wild plants besides berries. Oh, that was a bear, wasn't it? Yeah, sure is. Guess we put on that grass skirt. This wooden shoe. What is this? Button down shirt? Surely that has better insulation value than a fleece. It's possible that it doesn't, but I just assume that it does for whatever reason. And I feel like I feel like that little area was right up here. I must be wrong though. Because it's not. I didn't think I ran that far. It's funny with the um, the backpack strap across my shoulder. It kind of looks like I have a tie on. Oh, this is this place? This is the first one I came to, wasn't it? With the carrots? Maybe not. No, this is a totally different... A totally different place. Let's take the sharp rock. More sharp rocks, more baskets. 
Yeah, I'm not doing very good for uh, for an early start. No, put it down, take out the thing when I right click on it. I'm sure we were just to the left of a swamp. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm just totally lost now, so it doesn't even really matter. Here's some carrots. This wasn't the one, was it? Yeah, it is. Absolutely is. Okay. Here's what we do then. This is my new home. Dig this one up and use it for other things. Alright. I see a snare too, and there's these. Uh, but once again, if I don't have needle and thread, I'm going to be in trouble. Let's come over here and grab this. And eat it. Okay, let's go steal from our old village. Oh, yep, figures. I've gone way too far to make it back uh, and get healed, so that's not a possibility. Oh yeah, this is going to be really good for my uh, overall genetic fitness. Just get some yellow fever and die. How about? How about we just do die? There we go. How does that affect my genetic history? Yeah, minus three, because I was abandoned by my uh, mother. That makes perfect sense. Hammer family. Okay. Dry diesel water pump, that's terrible. Capitola? Captain Prince? Captain Price? What does that mean? Now I've been kidnapped. Unless you're planning on taking me to a place to get clothes. I'm fleeing from you. Haha! -ha! You fool. <laughs> ORP drama. It's so good. It's good. Wonderful. I feel safe. Fantastic. Oh man. Peter is a baby kidnapper, that's correct. He totally did that exact thing. There's all kinds of clothes inside the this building. I just saw them. Yep, absolutely. Brand new. I've never seen this game before in my life. What a piece of trash. Oh, wait a second. Yeah, thank you, finally. Good grief. It's only been three years. Oh, and the feathered cap right away, she knew. Magnificent. Oh, so good. So many pockets. Oh, man. Now she's stolen my feathered cap. Oh, she's done for the day. I'll take those shoes. Mom is what? Stan's eating? Well, I apparently can't do any dang thing either, so... Traitors? There we go. Okay. Let's go do things. Uh, was that kerosene in there? Empty tanks. All of them. So now we need to find the oil. Uh, 
Get it turned into diesel and all that kind of stuff. A pig! Delicious. Um, yeah. We'll steal one of these. Steal one of these, just to have them on us. Several bowls of carrots and berries. There's a lot of flies flitting around. And who's eating all of the berries, too? That's a bit of a shame. Because now I can't eat berries. Realize I'm just a child, right? Berries are about the best thing for me that I could possibly have to eat. Here's some. Ah, it's popcorn in there? I mean, technically, we could just do like this. Alright, we are fully clothed. I mean, our um, apron doesn't really provide us with that much insulation, but it's okay. Just have to put up with it for now. White blank dye. I forgot even how to make those. I'm pretty sure they're made with clay. It's a very large pin. But it's not, uh, not quite constructed yet. No. I hadn't seen that shadow on there before. It looked red to me. I thought it was a, a bloody rabbit hole. I was about to be very, very distraught. Oh, what was I thinking about looking for? Oil? There's only five Tari spots on the entire map now. Uh, because Jason is a sadist and loves to see everyone suffer and die. And uh, for the arcs to expire needlessly and quickly. Without any reason. Except for his own personal entertainment. So, yeah, that's a thing that we have to deal with. I guess he is the developer or whatever, so we have to respect uh, the direction that he takes the game. Because we can't do anything about it anyway. I'm not bitter. So yeah, finding oil is going to be madness. Unless there's a road around here that leads directly to it. It's going to take us ages to locate. What are these? Geese? Just a whole load of cooked geese? Okay. And my character looks angry. I think they only spawn in uh, in snow biomes now. I think is what the change log said, which doesn't make sense either. The way that they spawned before in snowy and desert biomes uh, makes more sense. And having more of them was a smart thing. I can't... I'm not old enough to ride that stupid horse, am I? Yeah, I'm not. Oh, no. Yeah, here's some snow. I was sure I was dead just then. Okay, we're able to run a little faster now. Let's eat this goose. Let's drop those bones. I'm pretty sure that the change log said that uh, oil spawns in snow now, but I could be wrong. If they have a diesel engine and there's uh, empty kerosene tanks or whatever around, one would assume that they have found oil before somewhere. But who knows if anybody knows where it is anymore. The person that discovered it could have died and no one was listening to him share their discoveries. That happened to me before. Alright, we're young and crazy. Some unfinished structures and stuff. I'm pretty sure I live miles south here. Let's grab this basket. Nope, this is it, isn't it? Yeah, I re recognize that... Um, String that was up there. The ball of string. I should have asked that old person if she knew where the oil is. What the heck? Oh, I'm on, on shrooms. Like, what the heck is that? I've never seen that before. Of course I haven't.
That can't really be... It's a natural spring, it really is. Cabbage Bear Cave, wow. How am I supposed to know where I am or where I'm going? Bear Cave, okay. Limestones, all those eyeballs. <laughs> Amazing. Man, I'm not even having good luck finding snow biomes, much less snow biomes with tarry spots. I don't even know what I would do if I did find one, because then I would have to find a way to, uh, to fix that. Fix up the pump and all that kind of stuff. But if we're totally out of um, kerosene, then that poses quite the problem. Oh, let's pretend like, okay, this goes to a well at least, so that's something. And to a wall. This is a totally different village, it looks like. Is everyone here dead? It feels like it. it feels like this is a very, very old uh, village. I think I had a, yeah, had an onion in my pack. Interesting. I seriously doubt I would find anything of value around here. If there was a knife or something, I would take that probably. Um, but it doesn't even look like they have iron or anything. I haven't noticed. A smelter, at least. A forge, whatever you want to call it. They're still wearing rabbit furs for clothes. Huh. They probably all died out because the uh, sheep ate their carrots, and that's probably why. Probably. Never know. Soaking turkey bones? Because that needs to be cooked, right? in order to turn it into broth. Oh, let's just take that with us. We'll take this too. I think we were running north already, weren't we? These people in their walls. I've already talked about it too much, so I'll leave it at that. Dare we? Eh, it's a banana. Backpacked. Oh yeah, they got me. I'm dead now. Where are we supposed to go? A cold biome? I didn't have anything in that basket, right? Pretty sure. Come on, I have a six times multiplier. Give me a break. Wow. A lot of deaths right in a row. Man. Tragic. We'll try one more, I guess. My genetic fitness has to be going right straight into the garbage. This is the same, yeah, hammer. I don't even care to say hello. Don't care. Are you sure? Sure, it's not the dead person. Yeah, I think it is the dead person. The dead me for my last life. It is actually whole milk and not lime. Amazing. Yeah, yellow fever seems to be a lot more serious than it used to be. I was pretty sure I was almost full, and I had a six times multiplier. So I thought I would be able to survive, but it clearly didn't work out that way. <laughs> He's sad. It's amazing.
Nothing. <laughs> sure. Will be the uh, devious family. It's wonderful. Yeah, any village this size is going to have creepers. Oh, yeah, now I can do things. Wonderful. Okay, taking this whole bowl of berries with me, and I'm going to go find my old corpse. Bye. 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 I don't know why I would go to find my old corpse. It was kind of a pointless journey in the first place. I just don't feel like sitting around in a village. I'm so tired of villages that size by now. I really do miss the uh, early starts. Uh-huh. There is a jungle. There I am. I actually had a lot of food on me. Nope, I've already got shoes on. Already got a backpack on. I don't want this. I know it has a pocket on it, but... Ah, fine. I'll take it anyway. Put that there. Put the shoes in the thing. Need one of those. Yeah, if I live long enough, I'll come back and collect these up uh, to take back to the village. But it would surprise me if that was the case. Got snares up here, that's good. Another jungle. Lots of dead mouflon around here. Around these parts, around this neck of the woods. Around this here place. Let's not get it. Okay, any tarry spots? I'm pretty sure we have to bring like a... A pipe or something, and shove it into the ground first. There's a bear. Man. The size of this snow biome, you would think that there would be one tarry spot of the five of the entire rift. I can't remember what the size of the rift is, though. Some stupid... Like 500 by 500, something like that. Yeah, there's nothing here. There's no... No tarry spots at all. Gross. Yeah, so our little village is just totally out of oil. No clue if we'll ever get any more again. It's horrific. Ooh, what's that? Long dress? No thanks. It's not going to fit in the basket. I'm not carrying it around. You have a sister, she says. Little did she know. 
coast. Pretty sure my home marker is not pointing me home. I could be wrong about that though. It's a baby sheep running around. I was thinking we live more this way. Yeah. This isn't my town. The heck? Okay, found the Badlands again. Now there were two jungles that we found, right? The first one... Oh, here's the snow already. How'd I get that far north that fast? Nope, this is a totally different little snow biome. I'm totally lost now then. I thought I knew where I was, but I'm totally lost. Oh well. Maybe we will go towards this home marker. Since it doesn't have a distance marked in numbers or whatever. It should be fairly close, I guess. And it could actually be my real home. Oh, I still had that banana. Ugh. Gross. I'm about to just go die and uh, forget about my genetic fitness entirely. Another feathered cap, good. Yeah, I've been here before. Been here before. Ugh. Raw tortilla chips, too. Okay. Is there not... They only stack up to three? Oh, that's got a uh, stuff in it. Is it broken? Hitched, horse-drawn, tire guard. It's broken. Great. Okay. Hello? Oh, I'm not, I'm not freaking old enough. That's such a dumb restriction. Oh, man. I swear, guys. This game... It's harder and harder to play every time. There's so many things that would be so beneficial to change, but it'll never happen because Jason just wants us all to uh, suffer and die. The whole reason I play video games is to get away from the whole concept of all life is is suffering and death. So, um, yeah. This is the opposite of what I want to be involved with when I go to play video games. It's not fun for me. I know other people have fun with doing stuff like this, but yeah. it's just getting to the point where it's really tedious and uh, unnecessarily, unnecessarily difficult. I always figured that uh, game developers wanted to make fun games, but I guess that's an obvious misreading of the statement. Any statement. Because lo and behold, there's plenty of uh, developers that create really difficult games. Fine, I'll do this one. 
Nothing. Is that the last of our water? I think it was. Oh man. Okay, there's some over here in this one. So that's fine. I try to go do something and then I just die. Now they're killing each other down here. <laughs> they just healed her up. <laughs> it's not why she said. <laughs> Yeah, he's trying to feed my mom, too. Amazing. Didn't I eat out of one of these berry bowls? Here. Have that back. Didn't I have a, a thing? Yeah! <laughs> Just kills her again right away. Oh, man. Oh. Yeah. There, she finally died. Oh, I wish it was me. Maybe it will be here in a second. I might just not... Yeah, I might just not worry about it. My poor mom's... They're fine. My poor mom's uh, genetic fitness is the only reason why I did that. Have I just had a child? Oh, no. You are... Ferdinand. Yes, it is. Yes, it is always. It is absolutely always. In this game. Ah. Oh. I need some milk. He's probably worried that I'm going to uh, dump him off in the wilderness and that he'll die. Little does he know though. Uh, poor doggo, all hungry and sad. Just about to say, have I gone too far? I feel like I've gone too far. There. He's wearing my old clothes now, and I'm wearing my old clothes, or my sister's old clothes from my past life. Amazing. All right, here we are back again. Okay, all the madness has stopped. Everyone's everyone's dead. Oh, I was about to say. That's not even my mom, though. I can't see who it is. My aunt. My evil aunt. It's fine. Yes, the gate is broken down. It's magnificent, and I can't believe I lived old enough to, uh, to have a kid. I don't know if he wants the skirt or not. I 
I don't actually know which one is more insulation. I probably ought to learn those kinds of things. And if we don't have infinite sheep food, I don't know what we have. Loads of bowls and berries and carrots for a great aunt. Who's this lady following me around? Oh, my, my mom. Yep. Ah, oh, it's so cute. Aw. Oh. Aw, oh, how precious. Aw. Oh. Aw. Oh. Now there's stews here too, that's good. Raw stew pots as well. Bowls of salsa. Raw tortilla chips. Weren't there raw fries up here, too? No, that was a different life. That's fine. I don't know why we need so many mining picks. You never need more than one in a village. Because you're never going to find that much iron. Yeah, still got a well over there. These? Oh, dry beans? I thought those were green beans. Did I already eat a carrot in this life? I didn't. And if I live much longer in this life, though, I can't, uh, I can't really... What are they doing? Why are they picking all of the berries and ruining all the bowls? This has to be griefer work. It has to be. Oh. You are... I don't even care. What's this kid's name? Ferdinand? Ferdinand? You are... Nice, sure. Niasha, perfect. Why'd she have a baby pig in her pocket? <laughs> yep. There you go, child. Oh, man. Maybe if any of these kids can survive. Oh, yeah, I'll drink some whole milk. Yep, there's a bakery. Lots of foods. I'll just tell them. Lots of foods. Yep. Experiment. Do. But. Wait. What the heck? Do what you want. Ye? Yes. Wonderful. Anything you want to learn? Well, 
we have enough tools. Um, I can still smith. Bit of a waste, though. Better off cooking. Uh, that fine. Awesome. Uh, if you need anything, let me know. Food? There you go. Oh, uh, right click on the plate. Plate. Right click to drop. Now, uh, right click bread. There we go. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, you can eat berries out of bowl. Who's Unica? Is that me? Yeah. Want to get in on some strange? What's he talking about? Stranger Things? That uh, that show? I think I think that's what he's talking about. Pretty sure that's what he's talking about. What's he frowning about? Yeah, I can't can't pick him up anymore. Okay, well, hopefully he learns when he needs to. I think it was a boy child. I can't remember now. Uh, did I ever pack a bowl? I did. And there's got to be water around here somewhere. If there's not, we can get some. Do we not have sheep? Weren't there a bunch of wild sheep running around? I don't think we ever had any in the actual pen, did we? What in the pen over here? Yeah, it's not finished. Yeah, that one should be there, I think. Uh, people are still killing each other. It's so unnecessary. Does this still work? The uh, the corner pieces like this, and then you place um. And you plant the berry bush or whatever in the middle. I mean, I don't think we need all four corners, but they're here, so I guess why not? Pretty sure you have to actually place them in the ground, though, or whatever. So we need to find stakes in order to do that. And I'm already hungry again, and I'm already tired of this life. Holy cow. I've already played those other lives where I died horribly. I don't want to use my uh, bowl on stew, but there we go. I did it. I guess I could have gone with milk, because I've already ruined my yum meter for whatever reason. I can't remember what I ate two of. Um, okay. Let's get some soil and stuff, I guess. Get this pan up and running. I don't know if it's going to do us any good or not.
feed me. That was that strange kid saying that. Why is he like this? Crazy child. Oh yeah, that one's already got a bunny. That's perfect then. Because then all we have to do is uh, drop this one. No, you idiot. There. Yep. I did it, folks. I did it. I reset my yum meter yet again. I'm crazy. I don't even care. Is there anything else that we could plant in these that won't go bad and die off? Like uh, corn or something? Plant in there. And it just lives forever. There. Have a pocket bolt. Uh, this is fine though. We'll just take this. Because I need at least three. Anyway, I can cut them with the knife, can't I? Oh, I forgot I need a dang hoe. Let's come over and get this far one. It shouldn't be this far away from everything that grows. So we'll take it way over to the other side of the village where it doesn't belong. It makes perfect sense. Okay. Now let's get some berries out. Yeah, because people are always going to eat the uh, the dang berries out of these things. So that's why I wonder if there's something better uh, that we should be using. But I guess people will eat anything. So if we use corn, they would pick the corn and then they would uh, use it on stuff. If we used um, squash, they would chop it out, take it somewhere. There. Um, water. I have my pocket bowl, so we just need a bucket. Wasn't there a... No, it was a different life, wasn't it? That there was a, a pen down here. No, there is totally a pen down here with sheep in it. So everything that I've done is for nothing. Beautiful. Always makes me feel good about my life. Just leave that there then, I guess. Uh, grab that soil in that bolt. Yeah, uh, with, yeah, yeah, uh, now put on, uh, brown bush. Yeah, now water. <laughs> in bolt. I wasn't specific. Oh, um, yeah. There you go. Perfect. 
So that's how you tend berries. Good job. All these bowls uh, with carrots can be fed to babby lambs. Yeah. Don't want to snack on just berries. Try uh, different foods. Okay. All right, well, we didn't uh, water the berries or whatever, so who cares? It'll be fine. Hmm. Not sure I'm old enough to just uh, let my life take by and go ahead and perish. I'm so tired, though, folks. I really need to get some sleep. I've got to edit the video and then edit a different video and render him and ugh. So I think I'm about done with this live here. I think a lot of people seem to be, honestly. And I guess this is where all of the clothes go or whatever. Yeah. Ugh, of course I just popped out a kid. I guess I give the kid all of my clothes. Nope, it died. That's fine. Ugh, okay. Let's just run away. I hope that my new kid learned something. That they grow up to be a helpful member of society. All that kind of stuff, right? All parents want that, don't they? I just now realized I uh, still have my wooden shoes on. Maybe I'll die somewhere close to uh, close to home then. In that case, just in case anybody else wants shoes later. Yeah, this looks like a cultish spot to die. Perfect. Oh man, it's been a long day, folks. <sighs> I am ready. Yay! What am I at? Negative five? Down to 25, holy cow, because all those deaths. My little sisters couldn't stay alive. I couldn't stay alive. We're in 432nd place, that's amazing. Wow. Maybe in the future I'll be able to... not be so dang tired and be able to... Um, build that back up again. We were up in the high 40s before... I think 48, I think, was one of the highest scores that I ever had. We were at position like 16 or something, 12, something like that. Well, that's it for this episode, though. If you want to catch another one, be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel through the Patreon link down in the video description. And feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. I thank you so much for all the time that you spend on my channel, and I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you. Farewell.